hey guys welcome we are back onto another interview and you know anytime we come we bring you another person for you to know what they are doing and also to encourage you and get you started as well well today before we get to meet my guest if you like what i'm wearing it was given to me by taylor Ware. you can follow him on instagram at taylor Ware underscore hope plates foundation now the interesting thing about buying this shirt is that anytime you make a purchase portions go out to a charity called hope plates foundation so let's all encourage and help a brother and a sister who is less privileged okay you can also follow me on instagram at aki underscore okumo on facebook too is aki underscore okumo and then on twitter is aki underscore okumo one let's see who my guest is for today Benjamin Odatai Lamte is a second year student of the University of Ghana, Legon. He is the CEO of the town Pasnigas. He is inspired by his father, loves music, playing video games and traveling. Today's entrepreneur is... My guest is here, Benjamin. Hi! Hello! 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 Fine, how are you? I'm fine. So. Great, great. I'm doing good. Thanks, mm. thanks. Thanks for making time for me. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> so, I thought bus sneakers. First, I'm, I'm, I'm gone. Okay. And then when you say I can't pass, it's like some elderly man. Yes, I'm heavy man. Yes. Why, why would you take that name for your sneaker brand? Okay, um, I think it started 2014, you know, um, I used to have this Facebook account, Benjamin Ozil Papi. Okay. Again? Benjamin Ozil Papi. Ozil? Yeah, Ozil hey. is a footballer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the Papi is Papi Kudu. Oh, okay. And I used to dress like him, you know, sweat top, uh -huh. jeans and then sneakers. I see. So I got, I used Benjamin Ozil Papi. I think I, I got hacked, somebody hacked my account, so I okay. used my brother's account to DM him and I said, Please can I have my camera like oh no, I'll give it to you. You have so many followers, so many girls DM me and all that, so I'll give it to you. I'm like, okay, no problem. It's nothing. It's yeah. paying me, but it's nothing. So um it got to a point I had to get a new Facebook name. So I asked myself, man, it's so papi cried here. I said, what do do? It's too lengthy. <laughs> Let me get a simple name. name. Put, uh, a guy name to be precise. Okay. So I'm like, okay, a guy name. So new came, that tech came, uh, plenty names came. So I thought about a tampa. Atampa, Atampa makes sense because I know Atampa means a leader, uh -huh, an elderly okay. person. Uh -huh. So I put my mind to my mother, oh man, what is the meaning of Atampa? I said, oh, Atampa means somebody who has sense, who is a leader, <laughs> advise people. And she was like, ah, what I would do the name for? I'm like, oh, it's my brand name, so I'm using Atampa. So that's why it's not there. Okay, so at first it was your Facebook name. Facebook, Atampa and then, yeah. Okay, all right. So when did you start selling sneakers? Actually, growing up, um, I used to love sneakers. You know? Okay, from the from days of All Stars, All -Star, yeah, Vans, Air Force. <laughs> you know your sneakers, you know your sneakers. So, from then, um, I used to love sneakers, as I said earlier. So, my mom used to get, uh, get her sneakers, like Air Force, Vans, to school. Okay. So, I think after Wasi, after mm -hmm. um, that's 2014, mm -hmm. I had to do something. I didn't really do well, so I had to do something, like make some money, make some moves. Okay. So, I woke up one morning, and I just watched my shoe rack, and I saw the sneakers. And I watched my brother's face. I was like, ah, why this mama face like that? I'm like, Charlie, I want to sell sneakers. Like, ah, I don't think they do it. I just woke up morning, I want to sell sneakers. I'm like, well, oh, I'm, I'm serious. I'm serious. <laughs> so I went, I went to my mom. Like, I really like my mom. Every time I discussed, I discussed Everything. Her. Yeah, that's I cool. I went to my mom and I said, I want to sell sneakers. It wasn't meant to do. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't want to sell sneakers and make some money mm -hmm. for myself. Like, okay. We have capital. No, I don't have anything. So we just. So what did you do? After talking to her, mm -hmm. you know, as she said, to get the money, she gave me some amount of money. She gave me some amount of money, sorry. To start. Yeah, to start. So I had to get where I could get the sneakers. So I used to I, I, I used to have an uncle. Like he's still my uncle. So okay. I have an uncle. He used to sell sneakers. Okay. Yeah. So I, I called him, he told me to come over. So I went to his place and he told me I told him that this is my story. I want to sell sneakers. And he said, Oh, it's been a long time since he sold sneakers. But he has friends who still okay. who still does it. So uh, he, he sent me to them. 
and okay. I spoke to them that I want to sell sneakers. So they, they thought I want to come and take it in bulk and take it to my shop or something like, oh, no, nah, I, don't, I don't even have a shop. I don't even, yeah, I don't even have a bag of cement. I don't want to go buy it and sell it. You get okay. it? They said, okay. okay, sure, sure. So we, we spoke to them, we came out on an agreement. Okay, so, so you would go and pick the shoes up from them. Yeah. How, when you started, how many shoes did you go for? It's just you order and I go and take it one. So if I get one a day, I'll go and pick one and I'll go and deliver. That's Was all. that not expensive for you? No, it's, it's okay. It's not, people think it's expensive, but it's okay. Because let's say, let's, uh, for example, I could get a shoe for, let's say, 60 cities. Okay. So if I go and pay at 60 cities, then I'll go and shoot it at the price I want to sell it. Okay. Again. So if I get like four a day, I'm going to take the shoe for. Yeah, I'm going to give it out. Go back to the house. Oh, okay. okay. Because I don't have a shop. So I'm going mobile. to them. Yeah, mobile. Yeah, moving all around Accra and beyond Accra. <laughs> Okay. Oh, you do deliveries beyond yeah, Africa. Yeah. You will come to deliveries. Sure, sure, sure. Um, you took money from your mom. You decided to talk to an uncle. You went through the process. Yeah. How has it been like? You started how long ago? Um, three years ago. November uh, before. Four years. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. So, how, how has the journey been like so far? Do you still move around like? Yeah, do deliveries yeah, 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 and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so how has the journey been like? Uh, it's been interesting, you know, um, fun and annoying. Three words. <laughs> interesting, fun and annoying. <laughs> annoying. Uh, okay, so how? What makes it interesting? Interesting. You meet people. Yeah. You meet a lot of people. Interesting people. You meet people who advise you. Who take the sticker and tell you, I really like your name. I like your name at Tampa. So do it this way. Next time do this. You kept too long. Do it this way. Do it this way. Okay. Yeah. Fun. Fun. Oh. You get start. I remember I went to do deliver ages ago. I went there said, Oh, come inside. They gave me a bottle of water, they gave me a drink. I don't have mm-hmm. to reject, but the woman said, Oh, feel free, have okay. fun. Uh-huh. You know, they, um, she wore the sneaker, it was very nice. Okay. She called the husband and kids, they came over, we ate, and I went. Interesting. Hey, wow. Um, okay. Fun. And then annoying. Annoying. <clears throat> annoying, dear, a whole lot. <laughs> Only text you on Instagram. Hello, please, I want this sneaker. Okay, what size? 38. Okay, please, are you sure you wear 38? I, I asked once, are you sure you wear 38? Okay, I wear 38. Okay, please, why are you? I remember somebody, I was going to give advance to somebody at Jolly. Okay. She told me, she said, you see Jolly, they have two places. They have the one at Press Chapel. There's a dancer called Jolly. Jolly, okay. And they have the, off the Madina Room, Jolly, that's where I And I asked them, please, which of the Jolly? So, oh, why I have Fiesta Jolly? So when you get there, I like them, call me. I'm like, okay. So when I got there, I like them, like, please, I'm here. I said, oh, walk small an act of a building uh-huh. you get me so i forgot it's the name of a restaurant it, i don't know it's very popular i think it has escaped me uh, so I, is I, it a chinese restaurant yeah i'm sure i'm sure i don't know that okay on that, road. on that road okay road. so when i got there he told me that oh any hole <laughs> oh but mom you told me i should use the royal fiesta uh-huh. so he said it's and rather than the 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 I'm like, oh. <laughs> so i'm like okay what do i do so i just went to google map and i typed press shuffle and okay. it gave me 15 minutes Okay. Walk or drive 50 minutes walk. I said, This one, I don't pick a car. I you walk. My back. So, you walk through, through um, the whole fiesta the area, side, street. all the way. Oh my god, yes, yes quite a yeah. hey. wow. Oh, but you try, yeah, I that's will. the hustle. That's the hustle. Okay, so have you had any celebrities purchase from you? Oh, yeah, 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 I got a DM from Keche. Okay, the taller one, mm-hmm. see, yeah, too short and tall. The taller one, he wanted Adidas um, Adelaide Slide. Okay. So and he wears 46, so it's very difficult for him to get. So I'm like, you give me two weeks because normally the, the, the least, the higher size or the maximum size I get is 45. Okay. So I had to call friends, you know, go to town, look for it. So I, I got in touch with a person on Instagram and asked me, say you can give me 46. So I go for seven to give it to him at spin test. Okay. And also Salma Mumin, I don't know whether you know her. Yeah, She's I know Salma. Yeah. She also ordered for uh, Timberland. She okay. told me she wears 41, 40 when I wore the when I. Sent the shoot was rather for two I had to go back and go and change. Hey, an yeah. annoying yeah. So at the beginning I've been doing the delivery myself and all that. Okay. Yeah, so car. right now, how how do you do? Because now you've graduated from your uncle's friends. Yeah, 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 yeah. To actually networking and finding the shoes yourself. So how do you get the shoes now? Okay. Funny enough, I get DMs from people. Okay. Hello, please I thank my sneakers. Uh, I have a an uncle, I have a friend, I have a brother who sells sneakers. My mom sells sneakers, my mom has a shop. Okay. Okay, so we want to work with you. Okay. So I'm like, okay, so what do we do? So you are like the middleman. The middleman, middle middle yeah. Channel. So okay. I go to see their shops, see the sneakers. Okay, this one needs to move the size and all that. Okay, okay. how much will you give it to? Because this is how I sell it. Okay. I have to give it to me this way so I can get some. I can get some you coins. Negotiate. Yeah, negotiate yeah. and all that. Okay. If it's cool, I take it. If it's not cool, then I guess you get it. Okay. 
Let's talk about social media and the Atanka brand. How has social media impacted your brand? Oh, social media has really helped me. I started from Facebook, only Facebook. Okay. You know, when I started, uh, my brother helped me. You see, there's this photo grid. You could just do Ooh. sneakers and all that. Yes. Yeah. So we placed sneakers in them. It was kind of not nice. It was rough. <laughs> I had no option because I didn't have any capital. Okay. okay. Right. So we promoted it on Facebook. You know, people were asking. Uh, I shared it on WhatsApp. My friends, I told them, Charlie, oh, you I can start sneakers. Yeah. So they're like, ah. You with sneakers, you want to go food. I'm like, oh, I'm mixed serious, like I'm, I want to sell sneakers. Uh -huh. So people tried, people were buying once in a while, like yeah. And then that following year, I upgraded to another flyer. I did another another flyer. Okay. So Facebook, and you Facebook can promote as well, can promote ad and all that. Yeah. So I went to a bank, did a visa card, and I promoted an ad. Hey. And funny enough, they blocked me one hour, yeah, one month time, they blocked me. So I could oh. not promote an ad. Why? And it's very difficult for you to get customers if you don't promote an ad. Because your page oh, will just be okay. blank. Okay. You get me? So when you promote the ad, Facebook gives you the opportunity to choose the number, the age, the age range, yeah. where is it a car, nothing range, where you want it to be, and all okay. that. So, so where do you usually target your audience? Then Eighteen to forty-five. Okay. For the fifty and the sixty years, you know, is it, they are hey, old. Yeah, I know so, someone who wears sneakers and yeah. fifty. They think I have to try the sixty years. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's it. I'll call it okay, okay, okay. So then from then, so they blocked me. So I had to go to Instagram. So oh, okay. I opened an Instagram account and I deleted the face. So I'm no more on, on Facebook, Facebook. So follow Instagram. Instagram. Yeah, okay. yeah, Instagram. You have to follow people and all that. So mm -hmm. It's not easy. Do you easy. slide into people's DMs that you sell sneakers? No, 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 no. You don't do that. Okay. I only do that when I see you a sneaker lover. Let's have been to a place. I see you where I'm like, oh, hello, please. I also sell sneakers. In case you can buy from me and all that. Yeah. Okay. But I don't what? really push to them like I sell sneakers. And I buy from me. No, no. Okay. All right. Um, what's the least expensive sneakers? You've sold. Uh, way back, the list was 70 cities, but now the list is 100. Hey. 100 cities, that's the list. Mm. This is, this is, this is it? <laughs> <laughs> and it's the true. most expensive? Uh, for now, it's 600. Louboutin. Lou what? Louboutin, Christian Louboutin. 600, 600 cities. cities. People buy them. And, and people they are rich buy people, Of course, they are rich people in Ghana. People have money. Hey. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Louis what? Louboutin. Louboutin. Christian Louboutin. I don't know which that one is. Mm. I have to look for it. You have to look for it. They have nice sneakers. It's expensive. Very, very sneakers expensive. Sneakers are expensive. Yeah. So how do you manage? If someone should order Louboutin from you, what, what would you do? Louboutin. Do you go and pick it up from yeah, somewhere? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, you see, they, they, I forgot to tell you. I have people who take specifically some sneakers. Okay. I have a supplier. It takes Louboutin. Louis Vuitton, Fendi, only those three types. Okay. And these shoes are expensive. Again, okay. I have a friend who takes Nike, Vans, Jordan, slippers, and all that. Okay. So I need a part to get things from. So oh, if, okay. you, if you order Louboutin, I just go to him. Okay. Louboutin, four. Okay. If you then, order this, you just go, go to this that. Place, that's all. Oh, so you're like the, the go to person. Go to, yeah. Very hard. Hit hard. That's I see. Yeah. That's really interesting. Very cool. Okay. Let's talk about you. Aside shoes, aside yeah. middleman negotiation, negotiating, um, moving around, who is Benjamin? Benjamin. Oh, Benjamin is a 22-year-old boy. Oh, you don't look 22. Yeah, I don't look 22. Yeah. I look so mature. <laughs> no, no, you took the name at hand, pal. Yeah, like, you yeah, yeah. don't look 22, 22 at all. 22 year old boy. Okay, so are yeah. you in school? Yeah, yeah, University of Ghana. Okay, what are you studying? Political science and sociology. Hey, the way you. I'm political science. Hey. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm chopping the money, so. <laughs> Who told you politicians are chopping money? Oh, they have money, they make money. They know their moves, so I get I also know my moves. Uh, no. You talk about that later. <laughs> okay, so I'm, I'm particularly happy when I see like student entrepreneurs yeah. moving around doing you know hustling to get their own and all that how challenging is it combining academics Work. and working because I'm sure sometimes you'll be in class and then someone is calling for their order yeah. so in instances like that what do you do okay 
And at the beginning, it was very difficult because you could be in class and get like six orders at a go. Mm -hmm. But because you don't have anybody, you don't know anybody. And probably I've not introduced another person to this person that, okay, when I'm around, this person will come for it. Takes, okay. okay. So it was very difficult. So uh, you see, Legon, you can choose the days you want to go. You can, you can even pack them in a, in a day. In a day. Uh, oh, so okay. I packed mine in two days. Two days. So okay. let's say Monday and Tuesday. So when I did it to Saturday, delivery, full time delivery. Oh, okay. So let's say when I have, let's say my eye is next week. Full week, I wouldn't do really delivery. I just write on my Instagram and my stores. This week, mm -hmm. I'll be out of town. I'll not be available. Okay. So, no, no delivery. Oh, then you then found they understand a, me. Then they understand me. Okay. Customers really understand me. You, you found a cool way to, yeah, to move around. Move around yeah. yeah. Okay, so I'm intrigued. But then let's talk about um, competition in this sneaker business. Because anytime I'm, I'm on Instagram, I see a lot of um, sneaker pages and all that. How do you manage competition? Wow, competition. Is there a competition at oh, all? Oh, there is. There are so many people selling sneakers. Mm -hmm. So many. More than 500. There and then so are the buyers that many to... Oh, yeah. In Ghana, we are 20, almost 25 million. So, definitely. Mm, 29 million. 29 million. Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Then, I'm not updated. That's again. <laughs> <laughs> 29 million. So, uh, competition, competition is, is very key when it comes to business. You know? Okay. You just have to explore other people's weakness and then manipulate it. So okay. basically basically my, my my what I used to what I used to get my customers or what I used to break down the competition is that I save my customers number. You get okay. I save their number. And then you check up on yeah, them. I check up on them, how oh. I do everything is fine. Was the shoe okay? Do you like the quality? What okay. are your recommendations? Okay. Like feel free, talk to me. So okay. that I know my faults and my Okay. You your strengths and your weaknesses. Yeah. Oh cool. That's what I do. Talk of customers. Um how how is it like relating with them? Because I, you say you check up on them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's say you have a good relationship yeah, good with relationship, them. Yeah. But then some clients are difficult to handle. Yeah, yeah. How do you do that? How do you find the ease and the comfort? Mm. Um, I think I did that initially when I was doing delivery myself. Like okay. Initially, I used to do it myself. So when they meet me, I talk to them, I made them like, like oh, you're interesting, you're a nice guy. Okay, so when I save their numbers, I talk to them, hope you are fine, hope everything is fine. How is work today? Somebody, some, I both in this line to my name, my name and asked me, today, no way. I'm like, yeah, I've not got an order. Will you buy a sneaker for me? <laughs> like, okay, yeah. okay. So basically, I'm very free then. Like, we what's chat, your we hang out. worst, apart from the job mm -hmm. lady, what's your worst customer experience? Worst. This one, the. We didn't feed that. Oh, we didn't feed that. Yeah, I remember. Uh -huh. Tema. I didn't, I didn't see the person. I, I didn't meet the person. But it's my worst. You know, she, she ordered for Reebok Classic Princess. It's a lady snake. Very nice. So she told me, bring it to Tema Habo. I'm like, okay, please, what time? One. Okay. So I set off around 11. You know, I am from the yeah. house to It's very far. So when I hit the motor, I called there. Okay. Hello, I'm please. On my, on my way. way. I'm there. I'm like, oh, please come. I'm waiting for you. And I got to come into one. Okay. I called there. Please, I'm almost there. Oh, I'm, I'm cool. I'm waiting for you. Come. I'm, I'm, I really can't wait to wear the sneakers. I want to even see you in person. So please come. Okay, yeah, I'm coming. When I go to the harbor, you see the harbor, you don't have a place you can sit. It's uh -huh. a busy place. There are no chairs. There are no place you can sit. Uh -huh. ah. so I was, I was, I, when I go there, I call the search off. Ah. I go there around 1.10. Wow. I like to meet my time. You tell me when I'll be there by 1. one. Because I yeah, used to pick cars. Today, yeah. so. so 1. I go there 1.10. I go there and I call them. The number you're calling cannot be rich. Oof. Okay. What do you do what in do such I a do? situation? Okay, well, maybe it's a network failure. I tried about six times. So <laughs> tall. Hi. I'll sit down. So I asked, I didn't even ask of her name. She didn't have a picture on, uh, on, her, on her DP. Oh my God. She didn't, have, she didn't have a picture on her DP. I was, people were looking at me and saying, ah, now why is this guy got a man thing here? You look so wretched and tired and all that. I'm like, oof. So I think I waited for one hour. Another uh -huh. time the call went through. Okay. When it went through, she didn't pick up. So I stood there from 1.10 to 3.30. How about the sound was scorching? Oh, like, I can only handle. imagine. So when it, when, it, when, it got, when when the time was 4 o'clock, mm -hmm. I had to leave. I had no option. So I just left. Like miserable, very sad because I was not having, I was not having money on me. <laughs> yeah, you were yeah, expecting something. Some like, oh my there. God. I was in the car this way. <laughs> watching the room. Watching the room from, from Tema to Akamo. Yeah. So finally, when I got to Akamo, she called me. Oh, sorry. Please, um, I forgot to give you another number. This is my house number. I forgot to give you the working number. I'm very sorry. I'm like, madam, please, you are not here to joke. 
please and please, I'm out of here. I can't bring it anymore. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. When I get to her grandma, I'll call you. I'm like, okay, she didn't call me. That's all. It's my worst. It's my worst. It's my worst. Okay. Because when I was I was getting orders, I could have yeah. moved them, make mm -hmm. some money. Yeah. 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 So basically, that's my worst. I will never forget it. <laughs> never. Yeah. We pray you don't get oh, such yeah, situations yeah, 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 again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you said you used to do deliveries yourself, but yeah. now you don't do them mm, anymore. Yeah, yeah. So what what do you do now? You use a courier yeah, service? Yeah. No, 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 no. I, I use a one-man person. You have someone yeah, who does yeah, it yeah, for yeah, you yeah, now? Yeah. I went oh, to do okay. for, I went to do deliver for Lebo and I met him at a junction. He, he called me. Okada, I'm like, child, you know, you want to go ahead to me. I'm like, oh, please, let's go. So I went and he told me, I'm like, I saw this thing. He was like, oh, mm, he's an Okada diver. Sometimes that's a game, man. He wants to work with me. He was a very young okay. boy. Okay. Okay, what's your name? He said, Smiler. Where do you stay? Kaso. Kaso, now she's not far. And sometimes okay. I get my goes out of Kaneshi. Kolebu or Kaneshi. Okay. Okay. So you work with me. I'm like, okay. okay, no problem. So now so, he does. So he the does it for yeah. So he does it from oh, since January, like the beginning of the year. Oh, that's so really I have to do cool. a video tell my customer that from next mm. year, that's mm. January, they will no more be free. Okay. Like they'll pay for delivery. Mm -hmm. You bring it to them. Like okay. I will be there and all that. You know, like, oh, okay, that's cool. that's really cool. You've created a job for someone. For yeah, yeah, that's cool. Um, um, so talk of starting. You you didn't really have it easy. Not at all. So, what what advice would you give to someone who is in school, such as yourself, that anything at all that they want to do, be it buying and selling, service provision, anything at all, what advice would you give them in regards to business? business. Just look into your camera and then share it. Like, what okay. advice would you give a young person watching us? Okay. The advice I'll give to a young person who wants to uh, delve into entrepreneurship or buying and selling. Like first of all, you should have passion whatever you are doing. Okay. You don't have passion, forget it. Probably you might be in for the money. Because I have friends who started they were in for the money. They got their 3K, 4K and they stopped. But if you don't have passion for it, forget about it. You will not get there. And also, and also you have to be hard working. You, know, you okay. have to set a goal, you have to have a target. Okay. You have to be, you have to learn, you have to read from people, you have to learn about people for okay. you to get there. You also have to have you have to get capital because capital has everything. You have okay. to know what you have to sell. You get me? So normally I advise people to sell what people like what people need on a daily basis okay. like the clothes the caps the bracelets the watches the belts like people need them in everyday life so basically that's it yeah okay so you say some people when they get their 3k and their 5k and they their they stop they have friends with how them. much k do you have oh i don't know <laughs> <laughs> i don't know they have to call my bank and ask <laughs> is, is, is it profitable yeah yeah sneakers? yeah it's profitable. Provided you can, I can look after my mom, my dad, my siblings, and some friends as well. Take friends, have fun, buy whatever I want to, whatever yeah, I want to I buy. I see you, like, oh, my chili pan. Yeah, my chili pan. I don't know what you mean. My chili pan. I'm down for the record. I'm going to be chill. I see. So it's cool. For me, provided I can do everything I want to want at a comfortable place, no stress. I can get what I want. It's cool. Okay, so what does the future look like for Atampa? Future is very bright. Atang Pass sneakers will blow. Like it's, it's on a gradual process. Okay. Future is Looking at bright. starting a Atang brand, brand of sneakers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Atang brand of sneakers. Yeah, China. Yeah, we call. We go, we get there. We go to China. <laughs> you know, somebody ordered for Advance. I met her at the mall. She okay. told me she just liked my name. She doesn't yeah. want the shoe. Like, like the name. Yeah, Atang Pass. Like... So I'm like, oh, okay. So Atang you bought the shoe. Okay, no problem. Can I have my money so I go? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> The future is very bright. I'm looking at um, opening a shop. Okay. I don't want a container shop. I want a belt shop, like okay. story building. You know, top wholesale, down showroom, hey. and all that. Hey. So the future is very bright. So yeah, I'm planning. You know, I, have, I have a team. Okay. On the foot, I'm alone. But at the back, I have a team. Okay. They brainstorm with me and we learn. Them. That's that's cool. Yeah. You build together. So yeah. I'm going to put you on the spot, Hi. and we do that every time there's a person in our seat. Sure. Sure. So, me there. What I know is what I'm going to let you spell. <laughs> spell Balenciaga. B A L E N C I A G E. Hey, you know your shoes. Oh, well, I know my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we are going to do um, some type of shoes and then their country of origin. Maybe mm, sure, no problem. Let's go. Okay, so like Air, um, Air Jordans is from the US. US yeah. Okay, where is Adidas from? 
Is it Amsterdam? Oh. Yeah, you're in Europe, so keep going. Adidas, 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 Adidas. Is it Germany? Yeah. Yeah, Germany. Germany. Hey. <laughs> I like you. I like you. Oh. <laughs> 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 no, no. <laughs> okay. Um, where is Phila from? Hey, Phila. Phila, Phila. Eh, uh, Phila, that you know. Let me try. Is it Turkey? Ah, uh, no. Phila. I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not really read on Phila. Because I don't like Phila. <laughs> no, I don't, I don't. Tell me. Italy. Italy. Yeah, Phila, like Italy, brand. Okay, yeah, it's true, it's true, it's true, it's true, it's true, it's true, it's true. It's true, it's true. <laughs> and then my, the last one, I decided to take the old kinds of shoes because mm. now they're you people you don't do in them anymore mm. nike 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 us or yes. so <laughs> yes that's we've just come to the end thank you so much for finding time and for making time for me i'm forever grateful anytime someone comes to set um you take time off your shadows okay. to come and be with me so Thank you so much for coming. And also, before I go, then, ask, ask something for you. Let me cut you short. Tell it, bring her in. Oh my god! Uh, I had you a big fan of Vipa Max. So <laughs> I, had to, I had to do some solution to you and get your size, the color, and everything. So this is this for you. Okay, for kind of overcome. Yeah, the branding. Yes, 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 yeah. Oh wow, this is nice. Adding elegance to your, your feet. feet. Yeah. Let's see. Let me help you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, guys, guys, I can't that just blew my mind. Honestly, I've been dying to have one of these. So thank you so much. Always well, welcome. I got you. Always oh welcome. my God, thank you, thank you, thank you. God literally bless you yeah, and expand yeah, you. Yeah, thank yeah, you yeah. so much. Okay, so in giving shout outs i would also have to do this quickly if you like what i'm wearing it's from taylor where he um any purchase you make of this shirt goes to the whole plate foundation so please follow them on instagram at taylor where underscore hope plates hope plates foundation and then you can also contact them on 0509 i'll take the number again zero five zero nine three four four seven three three if you like what i'm wearing it's really nice also you can also follow me on instagram at aki underscore okumo this show brings you closer to the youth who are actively changing the narrative he's a hustler you can do it yourself like anything at all that you want anything be it selling shoes selling clothing phones what have you there's a market out there for you, so please don't relent. Let's all push and then make our lives a better one in our country, Madagana, a better one. Thank you for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you have not. Like and comment and share with your friends and family. Thank you so much again. My name is Aki Okuma and this has been today's entrepreneur. Hey, Charlie, you do everything. <laughs> you know what I drop my hand off? Hey. Hey. Off. I'm sure. <laughs> yes, so yeah, I'm sure. Yes, yeah. 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 Drop the handles. Let's go. Yeah. So you can follow me on Instagram at Tankpa underscore sneakers, you know, and then Twitter at Tankpa underscore uh, sneakers. And my personal page is at Tankpa underscore that. Thing, at underscore that, oh, that thing. Let's hook up and let's work and let's make some money. Yes, and, and let's yeah. buy some more sneakers. Yeah. And then you can also call him on 027 0275452683. 0275452683. Thank you so much for the vapor max. Yeah, Thank you welcome. so much again. Oh, let me hug you again. Thank you for hosting me. Oh, thank you. You didn't drink your. Yeah. Hey, Anna. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> thank you so much. Mm. Ah. It's a wrap. <laughs>